Let's do connections. We're finding four groups of four. Today we smokes, jams, cans, and mittens. Oh my gosh, they all end in S today. Yesterday they all ended in Y. Today they all end in S. Wonderful. Um, all right, mittens, puffs, kettles, spots, salt. All right, what are we what are we doing with all these? We've got whiskers. That sounds like like whiskers and spots, maybe like things you might find on cats. Um, mittens. <laughs> Kittens have mittens. <laughs> um, raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. Fine copper kettles and warm something mit warm woolen mittens. Yes, raindrops on roses and whiskers on kittens. That was the purple. Okay. Uh, well, I got it. Let's see. Huffs, binds, cures. Pickles, hmm. Things you buy at the supermarket, pickles, jams, and salts. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, well, pickle, I know pickling and smoking and salting are all ways of preserving. Canning as well. Hmm, curing. These are ways of, didn't we already have a category of preserving meat? We literally had that category the other day. But I'm going to try it anyway. We had that exact category already. I swear. I swear we had it before. Okay, well, they're repeating. Um, I'm going to huff and I'm going to puff and I'm going to blow your house down. Um, gasps. What's another? Wait, so the, these three feel like they're like words for like breathing with sound i don't know like what's the other breathing with sound word um pants because yeah you pant <laughs> like my dog okay my dog's name is rocky breathing heavily hey you know what i was pretty close with breeze make, making sound well what did i even call that i don't even remember spots pickles binds and jams this is the blue i mean Okay, so I don't know about spots, but you can like be in a pickle, you can be in a bind, you can be in a jam. Like that just means you're in a tough situation. But why would spots do that? I don't know. Maybe that's what it is anyway. Let's see. Predicaments. Oh, because like you're. I don't know. Spot feels a, feels a little different, but I'm in a tough spot. Like you could say that, but I kind of think feel like you need the adjective there, right? I don't know. I don't know if I like that blast blue one, but I, it's okay. I got it anyway. Um, I liked how these were favorite things lyrics. That's fun. I like that song a lot. Um, cool. Well, uh, not much to say. I don't think purple was purple in today as much as it has been. Um, I would have been disappointed if the purple was, it's a word with the S removed, just like yesterday we had, if it's a word with the Y removed. I like that they're, they're doing themes here. I don't like that they're repeating categories. That's a bit strange if you ask me. But anyway, how'd you do? Let's do the mini crossword for March 30th. Let's go. All right, we got the Saturday biggin. Fill in teachers, a sub. Okay, so it's plural, so it's going to be subs, short for substitutes. Pad Thai ingredient often. Peanut is an ingredient. Person who helps in buying a home. A realtor. I know all about realtors after selling my last house and buying a new one. Uh, that's gross. Ew. I don't know. Is it two E's? Probably not. Let's see. Magnon Man. Gun? I, I don't know. I'm not. I, I'm seeing BNT here and getting. getting uh, I hope that's, I don't, we'll see. Uh, paid back through an app. Um, refund? Through an app, though. What, I mean, does re, re, refunds? No. Let's hold off on that one. I should really be looking at these crosses, too. I would be blank if I didn't mention. Ooh, I don't know what word goes there. Connery, who blamed, no, okay, so Sean. I think that's how, <laughs> I think that's the correct Sean. Indigenous group once led by Tecumse. Ooh. Is subs wrong? I don't know. Wait, what's this? Safari destination, UAL? Okay, something's wrong. Is it peanut or subs or both? I'm thinking it's peanut. Let's look at all these downs to see if we can figure out. Snacks made on sticks. 
most valued cryptocurrency. Okay, so this is Bitcoin, so it's not peanut, unfortunately. Um, all right, Bitcoin. So what's a safari destination? I don't know. I'll have to hold off on that one. S snacks made up. Whoa. Snacks made on sticks. Um, I'm not sure which snack they're talking about. Eggs on to, pr I don't know. To pr <laughs> to, uh, not sure. Okay. Let's, let's get back on track here. What was 12 across? I would be blank if I didn't mention. Ugh, okay. Um, let's just go through these. Indigenous group once led by Tecumse. I'm not sure. I already looked at that one. Stacks made on sticks. Channels that stink. Channels that stink. We have the S at the end for the plural. Um, I'm not sure. It's got to be like a play on words, right? Eggs on. Excite with up. Rev up. Combat sport for short. MMA. Okay, back to this. What what other pad Thai ingredients are there? Like noodles, uh, chili. Uh, I thought for sure it'd be peanut. <laughs> um, darn, I can't think what ingredient they'd be talking about. Okay, isn't there like oyster sauce or something too? That doesn't seem to fit. Okay, um, Magnan Man. Oh. Co, co, is it is it co magnon or co? Oh, it's in the back of my head. It's like the an ancient pre human, right, or something like that. Paid back through an app. Oh, Ven Venmo Venmoed. That could be that could work because he paid back through an app. He Venmoed. Yeah, that works. Um, I would be blank if I didn't mention. Remiss. Remiss. Now that I got that M, that helped. Okay, we're back to this. Indigenous group. Is it Shawnee or Scott? I, I'm not actually sure. What's this word? Channels that stink. Ewers. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Pewers? Pewers? Because you're like, P-U? Pewers? I don't know. Sewers? Oh, sewer channels. Sewer. Okay. I get it. <laughs> I was thinking about TV channels, which is probably what they wanted me to think. Uh, eggs on. Oh, it's not goads. Wait, is it supposed to be goads? I feel like Realtor has worked the whole time, though. Um, prods? He eggs on, he prods. Yeah, okay. Um, Pad Thai ingredient. Oh no, I don't know this ingredient. Maybe I do and I'm just not thinking of it. Snacks made on sticks. Okay, what's this one? Is it crow magnon men? It might be crow. Snacks made on scores? Shores? What would... Spores? <laughs> uh, I don't know. This is going to be tough because I'm not sure I know all of these. Safari destination. It's a play on words. What even fits here, though? Indigenous group. Shot. Scani. Scani. Um. If I could just get this ingredient, I'd be done. Oh no. Uh. What's gonna be the most helpful thing to get? Oh, stack me out s'mores. S'mores are made on sticks. Oh my gosh. Yes, of course. Um. Shrimp. Shrimp pad thai. Okay. See, I don't eat seafood. <laughs> uh, well, I don't eat shrimp, and it's from my Jewish upbringing. I don't, I don't actually still keep kosher, but there are a few things I still don't eat. But anyway, uh, so yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't have pad thai with shrimp, so it didn't come to mind. Um, okay, so let's go over all of these words just to make sure I understand. So starting with fill and teachers, that was subs. Pad thai ingredients was shrimp. Realtor, we got you. I got Crow Magnon Man. I knew it was like Co or something like that. Uh, Venmode, that was fun. Remiss, Sean, 
Okay, Shawnee. So I think that was my top choice. Safari destination URL because Safari is a web browser. Okay. Not one I use, but most value Kirk Bitcoin, yep. S'mores. Sewers have channels and then prods. And then rev and MMA. Okay. Well, I got it. <laughs> it took a while, but I got it. How'd you do? Let's do strands for March 30th. Today's theme is camouflage. Um, hiding. I don't know. Is cam is that a bit? Like it could be things like stripes, like uh, tigers have stripes to camouflage or spots, things like that. Let's let's look around the borders here. Oh, cheetah, right there. So it's animals that are good at hiding. Maybe is this just leopard here? Oh wait, le le leopard. There it is. Um, tiger. I I feel like I see T I G a lot of T's here. All right, so what would the spanogram be? Um, I was gonna say elephant, as if that, as if that was down here, and as if elephants are good at camouflage. Um, let's see, what what's over here? I mean, chameleon must be here, right? Who wouldn't think of chameleon for camouflage? Um, I guess not. What would the what would the word be? The spanogram. It's got to go left to right. I see SLO here. I don't think sloths are good at camouflage, though. All right, what are, what are some more animals? Um, oh, ladybug? That's interesting. I wouldn't think of ladybug as camouflage, but I guess so. So we're going to do like SPO spotty or something? Okay. Our spanogram is spotty. That's fun. Um, we're just going to work our way down here. Dalmatian. Uh... Hold on, but I feel like this has to be Dalmatian. Oh, is it I A N? I thought it was I O N for some reason. Maybe it's because most things that end in shun are I O N. <laughs> uh, we've got a giraffe here. I don't think giraffes are good at camouflage. I feel like they stand out a bit, but they are spotted. So these are just spotted animals, hyena. All right, well, that was. <laughs> you know what? I'll take the break. <laughs> I'll take the break from yesterday. Um, oh my gosh. Okay, well, that was pretty straightforward. <laughs> um, so camouflage goes to spotty, but then the spotted animals, it's literally just spotted animals. It's not necessarily ones that use their spots for camouflage. So I suppose that makes some, some amount of sense, but anyway, how'd you do?